Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we are going to find the distance between these two given points in a three-dimension space. So let's recall the distance formula in two dimensions. That means the distance over here has been given and we are familiar with this thing. So the distance between two points in two dimensions is simply square root of x2 minus x1 square plus y2 minus y1 square and here is the distance formula in three dimensions as you can see this is just the extension of the formula in two dimension they look a lot similar so thus the distance formula in three dimension is simply d equal to the square root of x2 minus x1 square plus y2 minus y1 square plus z2 minus z1 square. So before we get started with our this calculation, let me call the first point as p1 and the second point I am going to call p2. And here is our distance formula that we will be using. So before we apply these values, I am going to call this point P1, its coordinates as X1, Y1, Z1, and the other coordinates are X2, Y2, and Z2. Let's go ahead and now we are going to fill in the blank so d distance equal to uh, let's go ahead and put it in value in our case x2 is 2 minus x1 in our case is negative 3 and then square plus y2 in our case is negative 1 and then minus and then negative 1 and then square and plus finally z2 in our case is 5 minus 0 square. Let's simplify now. In next step we are going to have this 2 and negative and negative become positive 3 square Likewise, over here, this is negative 1, negative and negative become positive 1 square, and then 5 take away 0 is simply 5 square. And as you can see over here, this negative 1 and positive 1 cancels out, so this simply give us a 0. So over here, we just simply got 5 2 plus 3 is 5 square plus simply this becomes 0 square and this is simply 5 square as well. Let's simplify furthermore. So this is 25. 5 square is 25 plus 0 plus 25 square root and this is going to give us square root of 50 which is d equals to that one now I can write this square root of 50 I can simplify we can write 25 times 2 which I can break down a little bit further which I can put it split it up 25 square root time square root of 2 we know the square root of 25 is 5 times square root of 2. So thus our distance d turns out to be 5 times square root of 2 and that is our answer. And here is your assignment. Can you do this problem on your own exactly the way I model it? You can take your time, you can pause the video. Luckily, I have already uploaded this video as well. Please go ahead and check it out and see the correct answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.